All right, they're gentlemaning to PS2, so they're just hitting every button except for except for Pokemon Stadium 2. All right, we get to go. Let's go. Ramon and Jim. Ooh, Sacramento. Ramon is here. I love that tag. That's really good. That makes me want to cheer for him more because he's like city proud or whatever. That's great. All right, anyways. Despite what I'm cheering for, Jim has done 86% and 97%. That's a lot of damage. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> ah, the forward air just barely too early. The moon's gonna punish that. Look at this. It's Bowser Jr., man. Jab, jab, jab again. The Koopa Ling is not gonna make its way to Mecha Koopa. Another bomb! Oh my gosh! There's no way! I don't know why he, I mean, I think that time he was actually trying to use it, but there's actually no way that he just got a third bomb in two sets. In two games in a row, two maps in a row. It's unreal. He's not even pulling that many turnips. It's like, the, oh, he's dead. Oh my gosh, he just dies. He got destroyed for that. Okay. All right. Bowser Jr. just, I'm not screw you. Okay, that's not going to take it. Bowser Jr. is, you know, that vehicle is pretty heavy. That's the That was a sick way to cover his wall. Ramon covers his recovery with that Mecha Koopa. Like, Jim can't just, like, float over it now. Very nice. Board throw at the ledge. Still not dead. Ramon again going to try to cover his way back. He's on the ledge. He's re-grabbing, but he can't really do much about it. Okay, that forward air is going to catch the jump. Jim only takes 46. It's not too bad. All right, all right, all right. They are just looking at each other. I like this neutral. Ramon's on the platform and Jim is like, this is a slight advantage. I would like to play this out. Back air. This pressure. Jim's definitely keeping like uh, Ramon off of center stage. Ramon getting backstage cleanly. But it's like, he's not in center. Okay, now he's in center. Now Ramon is taking center and taking advantage shade along with it. Great tech chase. This dude parried his get-up attack. I know what you're doing. Tomahawk down tilt. I think that was like almost safe. It looked like he could do something after that. That was pretty crazy. Mecha Koopa. He tried to combo Mecha Koopa into up smash. I like the idea. Side B landing. Oh, he's dead. Because of the, the aerial. That was so sick. What a great combo. Ramon times that perfectly so that his his aerial is what comes out last, so like it, it has where the knockback's from. Oh, double jump over him. Ramon literally going circles around Jim. Jim right here. Up air, up air, up air. Up air again, up air again. He's at 61. This is where Bowser Jr. combo, you know. A stitch! A stitch! He grabbed it. Ramon has a stitch. Bowser Jr. has a stitch. What will he do? He will not use it too much. He tried a combo. That would have been a crazy combo. All right, the Koopaling blows up in his hand like it's like he's playing solid Snake. We thought we got rid of Snake. This is mini Snake out here. Unreal. That back air is going to connect. Yeah. Ramon just covering the platform land. Too predictable, he says. I got you. Ramon really ran away with that game. That was something. Jim took an early lead and Ramon said nah. Or Jim took an early lead in percent. And then Ramon just killed him at like 100. With the, the... Oh, is that a back air? Is that what you call that move? Like when he's out of the... I guess it is a back air out of the... Out of the... The, the vehicle. Out of the Bowser cart. All right. Jim bans Smashville and Kalos. Ramon goes back to PS2. All right. Well, I can understand Kalos. I suppose Jim thinks he's going to get beat up to, like, the sky if he's on Smashville. Maybe that's true, but 
I always feel like picking a small stage versus like Bowser Jr. feels like nice because Bowser Jr. I, I don't know. Maybe it's like a matchup Bowser thing. You never know. Jr. Well, Bowser Jr. is here, and Peach is also here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So the bear then was what killed you. Yeah. All right. Dash tag. Upper, upper, upper. I like that. I like to see that. <laughs> he does two side Bs to get back. That was great. Hey, I can get back. All right, down air, forward air. Bread and butter stuff here. It's scrappy again. The beginning of the game was like this too, but last game towards the end, it's the player started just like, you know, playing things a lot more safe and take, trying to like squeeze every advantage they could out of like positioning and platform pressure and all that. But in last game too, it started like this, this like scrappy stuff. Jab, 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 jab. When he's gonna multi-jab the roll. So put you back off stage. Oh man. Okay, forward air, okay. Whew. Scary, bro. One of those jabs, he's dead. Jim's still regular get -uping. He has balls of steel. And he's gonna need that against Ramon because Ramon has a cart of steel. And drills of steel, I suppose. Landing back here. Oh, that jab's dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's, no, he's out. He grabs him. And he thinks he's gonna get the DI, but he doesn't, so no back here, but still, somehow Jim escapes that perilous situation. Okay, there's no way he's out now. Yeah, this time he's dead. For sure, for sure. I can't even believe he escaped that to begin with. That up smash almost killed. That was crazy. Not really sour spot, though. Let up air. Grab, back throw. And Peach is struggling to kill that forward air. Chased him all the way out. And Jim, you know, um, Ramon is trying to space out. Ramon is trying to uh, cover his way back to stage and instead he just gets called out all right can't talk <laughs> what boy bowser jr forward smash connected like two hits and it was over he's like nah that was good enough my gym gets out of that one that would have been a really nice position for ramon to be in after that forward smash he tries it again but it's just not the same situation it's not gonna work the mecha koopa jim gets hit by it caught off guard Ramon jumps away. Yeah, that's the kind of the thing about Jr. He can just jump away. Because he doesn't really have, like, crazy outer shield. But if he just jumps away and spaces something, it's pretty good. These jabs are so scary. How did that even go through his shield? What happened there? I'm, you know, I know a lot about this game. I'm not sure I understand that one. That was something. Well, the shield poke, I suppose. Maybe he let go of his shield. I don't know. The move has two attacks. Side B, all right. Jim is not getting hit by that. That's that, that's burning out right at the worst time for Ramon. Jim went off stage to try to get the kill, but forward throw kills at 135. Peach is pretty floaty. That wave land on the platform, that was so sick. Then he has two hits. Yeah, yeah, so the second one, he either poked or let go shield. That's what I thought. That was pretty crazy, though. Oh, Tomahawk up tilt. Landing there, shield pokes. Poor Peach. Gigantic head. Up air, up air. Ramon is tacking on so much extra credit here. All right, 73, hey, that's a lot for Bowser Jr. Because Bowser Jr. kills pretty early with that jab or the any of the smash attacks, really. And he puts you in disadvantage so easily. I don't know, this is scary. Jim's gonna have to get some sort of combo, but it is Peach, so definitely it's within the realm of possibility. Oh, we got some Z-drops, we got some damage, but nothing crazy. Oh, we're getting some, some turnip throw combos. Down throw, and it's even game. There you go, boom, easy. 96. That was that was the winky face turnip. I think that one does more damage. And the back air just kills anyways. All that effort for Jim, and it's all not, because all your difficult combo inputs will mean nothing to Bowser Jr. back air. Kills you at 96 at the ledge. Rough, rough. All right. We've got game three, 2-0 Ramon. 
Ramon's on set point here. Jim bans Smashville and Carlos. Looks like Ramon picked Battlefield. I think that's... No, Jim lost. He shouldn't be the one who's getting the bans. It's Ramon banned the other two. That makes more sense, actually. If I go back and think about it, why was I confused? Ramon's won both games. All right, that makes a lot more sense, so. Yeah, we're going Battlefield, for sure, for sure. Stop the battle. Bowser Jr. And you know, I think this might work out well for Jim, and it might not, but it's definitely gonna be a different kind of game. And if you haven't been succeeding at your previous plan, you know, I can see the appeal of mixing it up. Always scary to mix it up here, but you never know. It could be the beginning of reverse 3-0. So they'll play their set. Oh, he has the turnip. The turnip Bowser Jr. combo. Uh, that would have been so crazy if he gets like a Z drop up air and then like throws the turnip up in like four days or something. That would have been so insane. But unfortunately, it doesn't happen. That spacing is so good. Ramon is just like putting pressure and just running away. It's done so well. But now, Jim is getting a bunch of damage from his up airs on these platforms. So that's already his counterfeit coming out clutch right now. So far, Jim's gotta be happy with the way Battlefield has started. Cause that was a big amount of damage from his advantage. Oh, R Ramon is chasing him so far down, but Peach can outweigh him. Peach is not intimidated. Ah, uh, falls off. That's unfortunate. That could have been a nice tech chase. Jab, jab. Poke him with the Nair. Peach a shield. That's so rough. We were talking about it earlier here, but like... That's rough. Oh my gosh, this pressure is so insane. They're just looking at each other. Oh man. So many things Bowser Jr. can do that are just terrifying. Just look at him, bro. Peach's Peach Bomber gets gets Jim back to stage. He takes a Koopa Bomb, but we're going to take that when it comes to things Bowser Jr. can do on the ledge, and that's a jab kill. Bowser Jr. is at 143. He should die pretty soon, but Ramon wants to get as much damage as possible here. Big down tilt. Maybe that's not how you get a bunch of damage, but maybe he'll get damage soon. Grab back throw. That's going to put Ramon not dead, but definitely off stage pretty deep. Return to the forward air and up air, but it trades with forward air, but somehow he lives... Ramon has like 10 bajillion weight. He's so heavy. That forward smash is safe. <laughs> okay. All right, forward air hits. It's not actually safe, but it was safe in that situation. All right. Down air tries, tries to gimp Jim, get him to air dodge or something. Does not happen. Jim, double side B's. This is the true pinnacle of the metagame. Side B and then punish the mistech on the unexpected side B with another side B. That was pretty good. Jim's brain is evolving beyond our understanding. But Ramon is still doing the damage and getting the ledge trap, so maybe it doesn't matter. That backer almost killing. Jim has no float, so he's gonna have to up B here back to ledge. He does get back. This jab is so scary. Another forward air, still not gonna kill. Oh my gosh. Another Peach Bomber to ledge, he rolls, and Ramon is not covering roll. Trying to get over the cannonball to space a back air, but Ramon is ready for it to space his own thing. That jab, micro spacing so close to connecting, but just barely not there. What does Jim even do? This wall of Bowser Jr. Jim's not pulling a turnip right now. He needs, he wants damage. He wants output. Down throw back air. Tried to call it a jump, but there is no jump. That back air landing through the platform, very nice. Forward tilt, not gonna kill. That dash attack preemptively calls him out. That's gonna kill for sure. Turn, hit the spin, hit the drift on him. We're going last stock for Jim Rude. This is winner's, winner's bracket stock. And he's getting comboed at the stratosphere. Oh my gosh, all right. This is insane. This game is super active. A lot of advantage here. Put the Koopa down to cover him somehow. Oh, turn up. Koopa covers the way back to ledge, yeah, yeah. Jim gets in there, sends the other way. Ramon, once again, at this 
comically high percent. I mean, 158, that's ridiculous. And Jim, you know, can't quite find his kill. And I don't really know what he's supposed to do. That jab might be it. That's really close if it isn't. It is it. Ramon takes it. The rage jab at like 110 from roll distance from the ledge. Baz Jr.'s underrated, boys. This guy's crazy. He just walls him out the whole time. Unreal.